pro football fans. With CBSSportsLine.com Sunday Game Center, you'll never miss a play, stat, or story. Log on now for live scoring and breaking news updates, all free at CBSSportsLine.com. Happy Thanksgiving from all of us at CBS. CBS 4 News is always on CBS4.com. Explore Miami like a native. Discover the Miccosukee Tribe of Indians of Florida. Thanksgiving afternoon, 4.30, right here on CBS 4. Do you ever feel alone, isolated, like you have no one to talk to? One in three adults say they do every day. Why is it happening? And are you at risk? Investigating the loneliness epidemic. Sunday at 11 on CBS 4 News. Registered sex offenders. Their addresses are on record so cops can keep watch, right? We hit the streets of South Florida to find out. All I see is an empty parking lot. What kind of address is this? In a stunning CBS 4 News investigation, you won't believe what we uncover about South Florida's missing sex offenders. Monday at 5 and 11. Turn right. Straight ahead. Over. Turn under. Turn left at intersection. Destination ahead. Navigate your holidays. Now for a limited time, buy or lease a specially equipped Cadillac and we'll pay for the navigation system. Season's best from Cadillac. Visit your South Florida Cadillac dealer for this attractive offer. Residency restrictions apply. Affordable quality health care coverage from head to toe. That's total health choice. Storm specialist David Bernard, only on CBS 4 News, your weather station. All right. Kid. Microphone check. One, two, one, two. All right. <laughs> All right. <sighs> we'll call the makeup crew. Oh, boy. Great to meet you. Thank you. Cool. What's up? I'm good here. How's it going, guys? Hang on. I'm looking right here. Okay. All right, so what's the deal? Real simple. What's Thanksgiving mean to you? Wow. What does Thanksgiving You know what? That's a crazy question. I don't know where to start. Oh, man, it means so much to me. Just giving thanks for everything you have. Be thankful for the things in your life. Family. Family and friends. friends. Sitting down with the family at the dinner table. And grandpa and grandma would be on one end, and you know, we'd have all the little cousins. Younger cousins be running around making a lot of noise. Breaking things down in the basement of grandma's house. Just, just being crazy. You know, the aunts and uncles. All my uncles are crazy. A pair of uncles, the twins. Oh, boy, you don't know about this song here, you know. They were eating contests. Food fights. Lots of food. We had all kinds of food. That's when my mom really comes to play. Turkey. A big old Turkey stuffing, get your ham, meatloaf, lasagna, collard greens, pig feet, raccoon. Were you from the south? You never eaten raccoon? Yeah, I'm not scared of anything. Like anything on the pig that you could have, we eat. Cakes, pies, sweet potato sweet pie. Sweet potato pie. You melt the marshmallows and then you brown the top of the marshmallow. Graham cracker pie, and apple pie, pumpkin pie. Right after you got through with that second or third place. He's going outside playing the game of football. Going outside to play football. Found a yard or somewhere to play. Throw the ball around. There's a lot of trash talking between my brother and I and who was better. Mom get all mad because, you know, the khaki pants would get all grass stains on them. And you watch football. Just watching those games. Watch the games on TV. Everyone sitting around watching football. That is an American tradition. Just being part of this game is a very special thing. That's what Thanksgiving was about for me. Just food and football and family. I think about family. My wife. My wife. She's been my rock. Very supportive. My wonderful wife. Of me and this profession. She's always there whether it's good times or bad. Thankful for my kids, my uh, one-year-old son. I got one on the way, too, and I got a little two-year-old girl. My daughter, she has changed my life tremendously. I want him to grow up like me, but be better than me. I'm a product of a lot of different people's care. My dad, my father. He made it all happen. My grandmother, who's, you know, no longer with us. Thankful for my mom. My mother, um, who passed away of cancer when I was 16. I owe her everything. You know, without her, I wouldn't think I'd be sitting right here talking to you. I love you guys, and I can't wait to see you. I'd like to say happy Thanksgiving. 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 Happy, happy Thanksgiving. Just save me a plate, I'll be home soon. Love you, Mama. Uh, hope you enjoy the game. I think that's it. <laughs> All right. All right. All right, guys. All right, guys. Appreciate you. All right, guys. Let's go play some football. Football, feasting, and family. It's all part of the tapestry. Thanksgiving Day in America, and thank you folks for sharing part of your holiday with all of us. Today, the tradition continues here in Detroit at Ford Field, the Miami Dolphins taking on the Detroit Lions straight ahead. And hello, friends. I'm Jim Nance. Happy Thanksgiving to all of you, and welcome to the NFL on CBS in this a Super Bowl season on CBS. 
Football on Thanksgiving Day, it's a passion here in Detroit that goes back to 1934. Little nine-year-old William Clay Ford was escorted to that game back then by his father. The owner and chairman of the Lions, there he is today. He remembers that game when George Hallis brought the Chicago Bears here with Bronco Nagurski and beat the Lions in a 1916 thriller. Happy Thanksgiving to you, partner. Phil Sims alongside. And, uh, Phil, all the best to you, my friend, on this special day. Same to you, Jim. It's really good to be here in Detroit. The people.